Yo, a Jujutsu Kaisen anime character just showed up in Nightwing. No troll. I don't watch anime. I don't watch Jujutsu Kaisen, but I saw that and I immediately knew who the fuck it was. This is Nightwing issue 113. This is right before the Fall of Grayson storyline, where I pretty much this is gonna be like the arc for Nightwing. And this book is like a introduction to that, right? And this is his birthday. So it's Gotham at 5 a.m., right? And these fucking smugglers are taking weapons in and pain digitally. Uh, to bring weapons into Gotham and Nightwing and the Bat family come there to stop him. You got Tim, Damien, and, and Dick right here coming in and just beating the fuck of all these soldiers. When they interrogate the guy, the, the captain of the ship pretty much, like I said, he bought him digitally. He has no clue who the person is. Uh, they keep bringing it in. We can't take it to Bloodhaven, so it's mostly Gotham. But Nightwing tells the Bat family, like, hey, I gotta go back home and talk to Barbara. Now it's morning in Bloodhaven. Pretty much Nightwing does all Oracle's job right here, and it's because it's Nightwing's birthday. He doesn't want her to have to have any work on his birthday and stuff. They kiss and make out. She's like, happy birthday, Grayson. On Nightwing's birthday night, he goes to the, the boat where we see the captain of the, of the pirate chick that we saw in the last arc and asking her, like, what do you know about this, like, smuggling thing? And we find out she's actually the one that's stopping him from getting into Bloodhaven. She took out one of the soldiers, and we have the Heartless symbol on his chest. So we know that Heartless is the guy that's been smuggling these weapons into trying to get into Bloodhaven, but mostly in Gotham. Right before the big night for Nightwing, he goes into this building right here, breaks in, boom, like that, and he's trying to find out any clues. We see Nightwing turn the batons, electricity on for the light, and we see the Heartless symbol right here. We see some cameras, and he's like, you're watching me, huh? Heartless. I'm gonna I'm gonna find you, brother. So Nightwing tells Tim and Damien about the situation, and Nightwing's like, he's a murderer though. Now he's trying to create a fucking war, pretty much. Like something insane. And Damien's like, you better update his profile. Oracle or Barbara shows up to say, hey, let's get inside and give you the keys to the city. And on Nightwing's birthday, right? The, the whole DC universe, pretty much. Like we got the Clark and them, Bruce. The Birds of Prey, even Red Hope being the shit out of someone on the streets at the Gotham Mall, even watches it. Night Might, Bat Might watches. So Nightwing has keys to the city. He's pretty much like the fam most famous person in Bloodhaven, and he's done a lot for it. And then when they, they go to this pizza shop, right? Marvin George, and we see Jujutsu Kaisen right here. I'm like, this is fucking dope. One of the pizza shop owners tells Dick pretty much like, hey, you've done a lot for the city. You have helped kids that are homeless. They can actually get some food and have shelter and stuff. Like, everything's on the house. At the end, we see Tony Zuko right here, Gerald Cumberland, whatever his name is, and then Heartless. And it looks like the Fall of Grace, and it's gonna be dope, guys. I I'm super excited for the next arc. Let me know what you guys think, and the anime shit, like, what?